Hi, YouTubers and whatchavers everywhere. It's Mark with GeorgeSoon.com. I'm back in our video. Well, Vikings Blade is knocking it out of the park again. They've introduced two brand new shaving brushes that are absolutely gorgeous. The Dark Raven and the Fire Mare. And again, Vikings Blade just does everything wonderfully well with their products. It's uh, packaging, presentation, and product. The, uh, top marks across the board on this. These brushes come in these really nice, robust plastic cylinder containers that uh, I think can double also uh, for travel, really. Uh, I, I get that impression, but they're absolutely beautiful. Now, I've already had a chance to look at these. I, I took them out and I made a little bit of lather and rinsed them out and that sort of thing. So uh, I, want to, I put them back together so you can see exactly what you're getting here. So all you do is just pull this cap off like this and the brush comes out like that in a plastic sleeve and just pull that sleeve down. This is the Dark Raven. Isn't that gorgeous? Isn't that absolutely beautiful? It has a heavyweight alloy base, a black obsidian handle, and it has this beautiful soft knot of hair here. It's absolutely beautifully soft. I've had a chance to make a little bit of lather and rinse it and kind of take it through its paces a little bit. And in just using it without any kind of lather on my face here, it is so soft. It is so very soft, especially up on the head here where my head, where, where the skin is thinner. Just putting it up here like this, it is so soft. There is no scritchiness, there's no scratchiness. It's absolutely, I just, it's like it's pillow soft. It's beautiful, but it has some really nice backbone and it will splay out when you need it to splay out if you want to do some face lathering. The weight really is nice. It's got this heavyweight base here, so it will fall back into your hand so you have perfect control of it. It will just sit in your hand. It is absolutely wonderful that way. And as I say, I believe this canister also doubles uh, for traveling. So all you have to do is put it in there like that and put the cap on it and throw it in your dot kit. At least that's the impression I get. If I'm incorrect, someone let me know, but if I was going to travel with it, because there is a single air hole in the bottom there, I would certainly do that. Of course, I would make sure to dry it out completely before packing it away. Again, their packaging, their presentation, their product, all top notch. They also have an information card here. And again, it's beautiful. It's beautifully printed. And they have some information for the wet shaving, the wet shaving enthusiast. And um, they also say that all brushes will slightly shed during the break-in period. This is perfectly normal. Yes, any brush I've had will uh, shed a few hairs here and there, maybe half a dozen, eight, nine hairs. Then after that, you're, you're fine. Uh, but everything about their product, they even got their Viking logo character on the back there. Everything is just top-notch. It's an absolutely beautiful uh, uh, shaving brush. It's a really, really nice size too. Just feels great in the hand and uh, just going to be wonderful making, creating a lather with it tomorrow morning because I think I'm going to be using one of these. This is the Fire Mirror. It comes in a, well, a brown tube rather than this gray tube here and or canister um, cylinder and top comes off like this and you just pull out the brush product and look at that handle. Look at that handle. Isn't that absolutely beautiful? It is Fire Mare. I mean, it lives up to its name. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. And again, same type of heavyweight base. Feels great in the hand. Just falls back in there so you get a really nice grip of, of the shaving brush. Again, very, very soft fibers. Beautifully soft fibers. Nice backbone. Uh, I'm, I'm looking at it and I'm thinking it's going to have beautiful flow through as well. Really very, very nice. But that handle, Fire Mare, look at that. That is absolutely gorgeous. Fire Mare, I mean, it lives up to its name. Really, really nice. I mean, it is just, it's, it's gorgeous. And it really will give you a luxury lathering experience. I really do. Uh, I, I'm predicting great things from these brushes. Now, here's the thing. In looking at this brush here, either brush, but this one because it had the black handle base, I'm running it across my hand and I'm thinking, is this a synthetic hair brush? Because 
This feels like a badger hair brush. Now I have the Vikings Blade Dark Stallion uh, Badger Hair Brush right here. This is a badger hair brush and I've had this for, I don't know, a year and a half, two years, something like that, maybe a little longer. And this is terrific for whipping up uh, a lather with the creams and that sort of thing. And I'm running this across my hand here and then I'm going to this one here and I had to go back to the product page and double check and make sure that this was a synthetic uh, hair brush because it felt as soft, if not softer, than my badger brush. Now my badger brush, this is not a silver tip, but I tell you, if this is what a silver tip feels like, then wow. I mean, this is an absolutely beautiful soft brush. Why well, spend $100, $125 on a silver tip badger brush when you have something here that is going to be equally soft or as soft. I've never tried a silver tip, but boy, this had me fooled. I thought this is a badger hair brush and it's not a synthetic. That's how soft both of these brushes are and they look absolutely wonderful, don't they? And if you look at the, the badger hair brush right here on my, in my right hand, you can see that this almost has that blooming of that badger hair. And it's you know brand new right out of the canister so uh, that's it i'm really looking forward to using both of these brushes because they're absolutely gorgeous brushes they're beautifully beautifully soft and they have plenty of backbone and uh, it looks like it's going to be a great lathering experience with either one of these so uh, if you're looking for a new shaving brush please check out the vikings blade uh, dark raven or the fire mayor. I don't think you're going to be uh, disappointed at all. You'll be very, very pleased with either of these brushes or get both. And they're the perfect size to be your daily driver. And it looks like they will also travel very well with you. So I know that I'm already, <laughs> I'm already planning that if I'm going to do a weekend getaway, uh, that I'm going to uh, put one of these back into the canister and uh, put it in my dop kit and absolutely have it because um, that's what makes wet shaving so great are great brushes and great razors and, that what's, and that's what Vikings Blade has. Great brushes and great razors and great products. Uh, one more thing before I forget. I got to show you this. Check this out. This is my Admiral razor and brush stand from Vikings Blade. That's my chieftain. Look how beautifully that sits right there on the stand. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Check out the fire mirror. Look at that. That handle is just perfectly notched, so to speak, to just sit perfectly on the Admiral razor and brush stand. So if you're looking to uh, get a kit, so to speak, for the uh, wet shaver out there or to introduce someone to wet shaver, Vikings Blade Chieftain, the Admiral razor and brush stand, and the uh, Dark Raven or the Fire Mare. They're both beautiful, beautiful brushes. All right. Hey, thanks very much for tuning in. I really, really do appreciate it. Uh, please share. Please subscribe. Hit that bell so it'll give you a yell the next time I upload a video. Please check out my blog, georgetune.com slash blog for my comic strip, George, other cartoons, other videos like this. And I'll see you again real soon.